Let her sing. Let's just leave it. What's going on, fellas? Did I ever just get stung by a bee's nest? Or a hornet, I guess in this pile here, so I had enough and I figured it's time to light her. You want to sting me, your home is gone now. So this is the aftermath of that. A little bit of cardboard in there, put the torch to her 10 minutes ago. And now look at her. She's just starting to really pick up here now and get smoked out. Yeah, that hornet's nest, it was located right there. I was putting that cardboard in there because this was the side I was going to light. And I took three stings right to the arm. So I went to the other side and I lit her up. You can still kind of see the buggers buzzing there. Anyway, see you later, alligators. Sorry, not sorry. You've been evicted. So yeah, well, this burns up. I got to go in. I got to put a, de or a belt on the deck of my lawnmower. So that'll be done. Probably bring you guys along for that. And then later on today, the squirrel's coming up. We're doing the exhaust up on his truck and we got CB radio to put in, so. All kinds of good times, lots of fun going on. Tomorrow we're going biking, so you probably see that in the next video. Nice family rip there. Got the Honda all dressed up, ready to go, gassed up, fluids checked, tires pumped up, she's good. I can't wait, it's gonna be a great time. Good people, gotta love it. Yeah. Goodbye to the hideous pile in my backyard. And hello to a little bit more space. Now we're moving on to changing the deck belt on this nice yard works lawnmower here. 17.5 horsepower, 42 inch cut. That's what they call the shift on the go model. It's a nice unit. All right, fellas, belt's out. Or the deck's out, sorry, not the belt. Quite dirty, but she's only got to make her till the, the end of summer here. And then uh, when I put her away for the winter, I paint it up every year and everything. So we're just doing a belt change right now, just to keep us mowing and she'll get some more love later. This winter, I also got to put a stator in the motor. She's not charging at all anymore, so that should be fun. Can't really wait. Woohoo! And just like that, boys, new belt's on. Took me about 10 minutes. That's because I'm a little bit lazy, though. So this tab right here, this is a brake that's uh, released like that. That's the deck's engaged, and that puts your tension on, and it opens it up. So that one's easy to get this on, but th this tab and this tab... You're supposed to pop pulleys off, put the belt through, but ain't nobody got time for that. So a pair of pliers, bend, bend, pull the old belt out, new belt on, hammer, 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 and she's on again. I also always tape this once you get it rooted right, so when you're fishing it in back underneath the mower, your belts don't fall off and you don't notice because it can be a little bit of a pecker. So daily tips. like that fellas next to nothing left well boys she worked good actually not too bad at all so that's nice you'll notice the, the 420 is not home she's with the old man there he actually just texted me a picture i'll throw that in the clip here for you all loaded up with his side by side we're going wheeling tomorrow so that should be the next video or the one after hard to say but yeah now we're down to waiting for the squirrel here on the boys flying squirrel here we're doing a little modification to the 94 you can see we've got some muffler stuff going on 
That's uh, part of the old setup that was on the truck. And if you have a nice look behind us here, piece we cut off. She's gonna get a glass pack today. We're gonna do a little welding on here and get this fabbed up and see what the truck sounds like. What do you think about your first joint of the night? <laughs> I'm a little rusty. Those are some rough looking welds, but she's sealed up. We're just gonna leave the camera from here and let you know that we have the first section welded onto the muffler now, and then we gotta stick them together, and then we gotta clamp, put it on the truck, and then we're gonna hear her sing, take it for a little drive, come back, throw a dirty old CB radio in her, and move on with our lives. Truck, yeah. Okay, folks, so we're at the point in time of doing an exhaust job where we got both mufflers laying on the floor. So you can imagine why Nick's in the truck. Hi guys. Let her sing. Can't beat a 350 straight pipe, folks. Just can't beat her. Well, that old holder, she's coming off. And there you have it, folks. The final weld of the hanger is done. Here's our exhaust playing peekaboo. Shutting down the welder here, because she's a fussy old girl. <laughs> she likes spraying gas all the time, not just when she's needed. Now we're on to firing her up. Well, we got the exhaust on. I'm a little itchy to see what it's going to sound like here. Glass pack, thrush. It's the first time I've done an exhaust job on a truck I've owned. I'm ready to fire up and see what she sounds like. Here we go, boys. Moment of truth, whether you regret your decision or not. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, the side dump has arrived. Let us have an idol, Nick. Oh. Oh. Have we got any leaks? Oh, I don't think so. Jeez, man. Yeah, she sounds good. Come on out and hear her. What do you think, bud? I'm very happy with how that turned out. <laughs> very happy. She ever sound good? Yeah, she sounds good. It's got a lot more power, which that really surprised me. The truck kind of had a, a little hitch in it. We realized that uh, we had a baffle broke off in the old muffler, and we think it was clogging the pipe off. The truck had quite a stutter. It's completely come out of it. A lot more power. This guy's excited. <laughs> Ready? Oh, that's quite a hit. <laughs> She's a tweeter. <laughs> tweeter and a monkey man were hard up her can. <laughs> and there goes the squirrel, folks. A successful evening he had to get home so uh, we just rushed and put the cb in and got him on his way wired her up fed her through the fender and stuff but yeah she sounds good the tweet that it had is gone so we we're thinking it's something to do with burning off the paint listen to her you can hardly hear it because he's being quiet our kids are sleeping so thank you squirrel for that and thanks to you guys for watching